Welcome Aries to your Kashuk reading for January. Hope your friends are doing great out there. If your friends like this, please like and subscribe. Okay, friends, let's see what's going on with you in the near future. This is for a heads up for the next few months ahead. Let's see what's going on with you. About three to four months ahead, please. Three or four months ahead. We have the Hillary coming out. This is talking about using your logical thinking. So whatever it is that you're looking at, there's going to be a lot of logical thinking about the situation at hand. Let's see, what are we talking about? And pretty much we'll say the time is now. The Hillary always says now is the time. So whatever this logical thinking comes up to, it says you will be taking some kind of journey. If you're looking to go on a vacation, on a trip, the time is now. Um, if you're ready to renovate a home or, or redecorate or entering a new job or moving or any of these situations, um, the time is now. But you'll have to use a lot of logical thinking about the situation. Um, within the diversity uh, because there's going to be a lot of different options and a lot of different opportunities at hand giving you a little bit of diversity um, so definitely want to use um, the, your logical thinking of planning out the situation before actually just taking the leap of faith um, since there is going to be um, a couple of choices um, at hand that could be keeping you um, kind of um, maybe kind of topsy-turvy wanting to root really move the the pros and cons of a situation, which one's better than this uh, uh, situation. So knowing that you have a couple of choices is, is a very good thing, though. <clears throat> Having Archangel Gabriel over here is talking about using some great communication, really getting down to the knowledge. Um, the Hilleron also is talking about knowledge. You might want to um, do a little homework about the situation before just jumping. Um, so you're definitely going to want to think and plan the action before doing so so how beautiful is that and it's also telling you divinely guided through the situations of what is at hand okay. so having some great communication um really doing your homework and looking at your resources um, is going to be the best option for you in the near future when you get to this because it's going to bring in your nine of cups because you're really looking for what makes you happy um, if you're going on a vacation you want to make sure that this is the best vacation right because you can only take so many so making sure that you're going exactly where you want to go um, and it really does feel like it's really more um, kind of about you at the situation if you have already gone with someone who's already been to some of these places um, you know maybe you're just looking at it from your point of view um, but it is definitely about you and what you really truly want. Um, so definitely doing a lot of reflection and a lot of communication and a lot of uh, homework on what it is you want. So keeping that in mind. Okay. Really stepping into your power over here card coming out for you is the dove spread messages of peace and harmony and it does feel like that's what the archangel gabriel is saying let's make this a peaceful situation let's keep the peace within myself because i don't want to have an argument about the situation just because it's the diversity doesn't mean that i need to um you know combat this situation with that one you don't want to throw the pros and cons too hard um because it does feel like wherever you're going my friends it it's either one or the other but it does feel like Either situation will still make you happy. It's just really getting down to what is going to make me truly, truly happy. Over here, I have the rhinoceros. Be strong and courageous about this, this situation, right? So definitely want to do that, okay? So bringing in that power and that strength. Let's see. This just seems more like it's more of an excitement thing. I have a couple ideas. I mean, you know, if you're going on a vacation and you're going to either Greece or Italy, um, you know, they're either choice is really good. You see what I'm saying? <laughs> so it's not, you can't really on this situation, the diversity says it's the nine of cups. Like you can't really pick anything that, you know, it's not going to not make you happy because no matter what, there's prosperity and harvest. It's just about what's going to make you the happiest. 
Um, and that's a really a good thing because no matter what it says, you're going to have this great opportunity um, for the Ace of Cups. So no matter what it is, you're going to have this fresh new start um, or this fresh great vacation. Something that's going to make you feel whole, relaxed, um, prosperous, and super happy um, in, in, you know, getting your intentions done. Okay, it was something that you have been manifesting and wanting to happen. So it does feel like, hey, look, your opportunity, what you wanted, what you've been manifesting is finally coming through. So here's the chance and here's what you want, bringing in karmic rewards. And this karmic rewards is all about having a great time, doing the things you love, um, really feeling like you are doing exactly what you've been planning on doing. Wow. And it could be traveling the world. You know, maybe you're going to go from this country to that country to this country or go all over the United States, however it is. Um, but no matter what it is, it's going to bring in a cycle change. And the cycle change is really making you feel whole, feeling like you're actually doing something and taking a leap of faith and a risk um, of something that you really, really just really truly want. Okay. So it sounds really exciting. Um, so somewhere between... Uh, spring to early summer, I would say that, you know, you're going to have this opportunity to get this, uh, whatever it was you're manifesting, this travel, this journey on. Okay. Sounds amazing. Sounds amazing, amazing. Let's get some angel cards over here. Here where they are. Let's see what Spirit has to say about this. So awesome. Looks like it's been something you might have been, you know, been planning for a long time. Uh, you're manifesting it. You're planning it. Maybe you're just waiting for some money to get together. Maybe you've been gathering money, saving money. Something like this. Some of you might be traveling to go see your mother. Okay, so angels say there will be helpful people along the way to help you get through the diversity. Um, could even be helpful people who want to go on the vacation with you or journey. Um, but it does say, yes, get more information. So definitely wanting to get some information about the situation. That's a communication uh, that we were talking about. It does say not the right time because, no, it is not the right time because we are in, we are talking about the near future, not now. <laughs> yes, in the near future. Thank you. Yes, absolutely. Um, and this is when your success will definitely come through. I love how they always do that. Like, I want you to understand right now, there is, it is not now we are talking about the near future. <laughs> so it's like, yes, make them understand. It's not, we're not talking about today. Okay, bringing in big, happy changes. Okay. And it is funny because it almost happens every Akashic reading that I do of the near future. It's like, not now. I'm not talking about now. I'm talking about in the near future. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay. As funny as that is, but man, they really want you to understand that because they don't want you to think that it's going to be right, right around the corner tomorrow, right? It is, but down the street, much, much further, okay? Until next time, my friends, peace and love. Bye-bye.